Pete on Gracie. Halleck Gracie. Henry Gracie. R1, R2, R3. Let's talk about the objective of the Gracie Academy. It's been the same objective since the first Gracie Academy in 1925, which is to teach self-defense to everybody across the planet. In an ideal world, we would have certified training centers in every city. But unfortunately, that isn't a reality. The type of person it takes to be a certified instructor and to represent and teach the Gracie way. It's not easy to find those people. We've had a lot of trouble. There are, they're out there. They have certified training standards, but to get one for every city, it's not going to happen anytime soon. So what have we done? We developed a new classification, a new basically type of training location called the Gracie Garage based on the original Gracie Garage of our father opened in 1978 when he first came to America and decided he had to get started here. He didn't have the money to open a school, but he had the fire. He had the hunger to share the art. So we got a two-car garage in Hermosa Beach and made it happen. What do you remember from the Gracie Garage, original? 1978, I wasn't born. <laughs> so, but 1981, I'm born. A couple years later, I start noticing so many people. As a little kid, as a four-year-old, right. you have dozens and dozens of students hanging out. And of course, you don't have to have dozens of people in your garage. You could have five, ten friends. Right. But my father let everybody in. It was the hub. Basically, cop cars, police officers, people training from different politicians. You know, we had everybody coming to our house. Watermelon juice for everyone. Unbelievable. Yeah, it was incredible. Um, there were so many people coming to the house and cops all the time that people thought it was a drug dealing situation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't by any means. It was the dealing of something else very addictive. The techniques, the Gracie Jiu-Jitsu. But uh, that's the type of traffic that was going on in the house. Um, eventually, the Gracie Academy opened in 1989. And uh, things blew up from there. Now, the new Gracie Garage. It's any unofficial training center that uh, basically you open up, but it has to meet certain requirements. Number one, there has, there has to be a certain passion. You have to want to help yourself and help people and be a people yes. person. We call it the garage leader. Now, this might not be in a garage. It might be in one room in an apartment. It might be at actual school of martial arts. That's okay as well. It might be in a garage. It might be in your backyard on sunny days under a patio, you know, little overdeal. Basically, it's your own, your own way of starting off in a grassroots kind of, you know, developing your own foundation for jiu-jitsu. So you can, it can be anywhere. We say garage because it's pay homage to our father's beginnings here in America, but it can be anywhere. The requirements. He don't set it. You have to have the fire. You, as the garage leader, we call it has to have the fire to make it all the way to the top. It would, be, it would be sad if you opened the Gracie Garage, you got accepted and listed as a Gracie Garage, but you didn't have the fire to make it to the top, so you let down a lot of potential training partners. But don't let it go to your head. <laughs> Number two, you need to have access to the source, to the Gracie Academy curriculum. That can happen essentially one of three ways. DVDs, university, or certified training center. Yes, here at the Academy or any one of the CTCs around the world. Three, what else do they need? I almost recommend DVDs. If you have the DVDs with you, you can kind of change. If you want to go somewhere else, if you want to take it to your friend's house, can you do that? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, essentially, yeah, to have a mobile Gracie Garage session. Our dad, in the original Gracie Garage, he would have little seminars at El Retiro Park. He would like it. In other words, he has a lot of people that would come train at various times, a lot of private students, but periodically, once a month, he would have a, a huge Gracie Garage session at a park. He would put down a tarp on the grass and just use nature. That's one way to get a lot of academy. attention. Definitely. Yeah, for sure. Guys grappling, choking each other out, people are gonna walk by, it's great. What else do they need to have qualify? They don't wanna use a tarp. They need some mats. You need mats. They need like 100 square feet, at least, minimal. Wow. 100 square feet, it's two five by 10s. It's not. It's basically the size of one bedroom. That seems like but, so uh, much more. Yeah, 100 sounds like a lot, but it's not. Wow. Okay? Now, free training. It has to be free. You are not a certified instructor. You shouldn't lead people to believe that you're a certified instructor. You just have access to the information and you are willing enough and, and, and giving enough to share that with, uh, with other people. You're a student that's gonna be helping and possibly even teaching what you've learned through the DVDs or the university. Right. And therefore, you're teaching a little bit, but really you're still a student and you're learning so much more than most people who do Jiu Jitsu because you're helping someone else learn it. Teaching is the best way to learn. Okay, but don't, again, don't claim or make the, you know, try to make it clear or, you know, show others that you are a certified instructor because you're not. And, Think of uh, yourself as one point of a triangle. Gracie Academy, you, 
and your partners. So create that triangle and realize that essentially we're all equally important, but we just have the opportunity. You have the home, they have the, the desire, and uh, just share it and have fun with it. Absolutely, and let's make sure that uh, when you apply for Gracie Garage status that you aren't located within five miles of a, an existing certified training center. Why not? Wow. Because if you're near a certified training center, you should go there. Yes. You should use that. It's an amazing, there's not that many across the yeah. country, the world. So if you have one near you, take advantage of it. Absolutely. And even though the Gracie University curriculum and the DVDs are all formatted for very effective at-home learning, that was the sole objective in making uh, the, the, the curriculum available in digital format. Of course, there's something to be said about having a qualified, you know, very effective instructor overseeing your training. And that's what you can get from being a member of a certified training center. So those are the five qualification requirements. Let's talk about the virtual tour. Wow. You may have seen some yourself. We have them online already for other existing greasy garages, but you have to have a virtual tour. When you submit your application, we're going to ask you to upload this virtual tour. Five minutes or less. It must include essentially three components. Number one, an introduction from the garage leader. Basically your name, your martial arts background, your source of Gracie Jiu Jitsu instruction, ideal training partners, things of that nature. Okay. Number two, we want to see a 360 degree view of your neighborhood from in front of the training facility. So that number one, people know where to find your, your location. Number two, people know where it's located in the sense that, you know, you want to make sure it's, you know, people who are, who are prospective training partners looking at your, your location on the site. Uh, we want to give them a really clear idea of where they might be spending their training hours. We want to see every room in your house. <laughs> <laughs> no, overkill, overkill. Yeah. Number three, they're going to feel more comfortable. Yes. They're kind of getting to know you. Yeah, most important part of the whole thing. This can be a little intimidating walking into someone's house to learn how to fight. So what's the secret? On your Gracie Garage intro, let the vibe be very chill. So that people, you know, watch it, aren't intimidated. Don't try to be too tough, guy, uh, and let them know who you really are. Um, and then we want to see after the 360 degree view, we want you to show us the pathway without cutting the footage. The pathway from the front of the location into the actual training area, and then give us a close up of the mats, the training facility, and uh, everything that entails. Don't cut the footage, or it won't count, because technically, you could show the trip the outside, and you could cut the footage. And be in a completely different location. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then take them into the dungeon. We don't want that. We want it to be a very clear idea of, uh, of where they'll be training. Clear? Basically Virtual keep tour. it real. Very much so. Wow. Keep it real. Let's talk about the benefits. The benefits. Wow. You're not a certified instructor. This is not a certified training center. But you play a huge role in helping the Gracie Academy disseminate the teachings of this incredible self-defense system. And for that, we are very grateful and we will reward every Gracie Garage leader with the following primary benefits. Number one, free training at the Gracie Academy. What, forever? No. <laughs> as long as you're a Gracie Garage leader, you have credit for 10 days of unlimited access here at the Gracie Academy headquarters in Torrance, California, for whenever you want to use them. Basically, you just come down, let them know you lead the garage, and uh, you're part of the family, and we'll take care of the rest. You can use all 10 days at once, or you can split them up throughout the year. But uh, technically, Family trains for free here at the Gracie Academy, and uh, you fall into that category. Number two, 10% off all Gracie merchandise, apparel, juicers, juice bags, everything. Anything you need, we want you to have discount. Why? Oh, it's so important. I guess, major, you guys are just representatives. You have to be, you have to have the gear. People see you at the, you know, whatever, the supermarket. <laughs> yeah, really. They're going to want to train with you. You know, they're going to see, oh, you're affiliated with the Gracies, and hey, you, you know, oh, you do have that Gracie garage, yeah, you get into a conversation, now all of a sudden you're building a team. It's network. a great recruiting tool, and uh, we appreciate your representation helping us spread the word in your Gracie garage, as well as on the streets. So, we'd like to reward that. Now, early Master Cycle access, primary benefit number three, Master Cycle from the Gracie University. Yes. Now, what does this mean? Several months before the general public is given access to each master cycle course that is produced, you will be given access 